Today on Jolt, we're watching Apple. The company reports earnings tomorrow after the closing bell. All right, Brian, we know analysts have been cutting their numbers for Apple. What should we expect tomorrow? Bloodbath? Yeah, well, that's a great way to put it. I mean, the mood on Wall Street is almost as if Apple sold zero phones in the quarter and had no products called the Apple Watch and the iPad. Sentiment is that low. But what the market is missing is that probably over the next five years, they're going to repurchase more than 30% of their stock. And earnings, as a result of that, can go up over a dollar each year just from that alone. Apple's expected to reveal how their new capital allocation uh, program Tuesday evening. Market is forgetting about it. Big opportunity for bulls who want to get in. All right, what about tariffs? We know Apple could be retaliated against China. Uh, we know Tim Cook has been in the White House. Does it even matter what Apple reports? Have investors made up their mind? Uh, investors have made up their mind, at least right now, that they're focused on the iPhone. They can care less about the Trump-Tim Cook meeting. They want to see what Apple did on the iPhone. More importantly, they want to see how they're going to spend their cash, and I think Apple's going to blow them away on the earnings call. All right, and if you're looking for more on how to trade Apple, come to the streets investing boot camp on May 5th, hosted by our own Jim Cramer. And PayPal CEO is going to be there. He's going to give information that you can't find anywhere else. People need to be there. If not, I mean, you're just missing out. All right, go to events.thestreet.com slash teachin' to buy a ticket.